So I wanted to, I've been wanting to do a blog, a blog, a vlog for a while. And I just never seemed to have the motivation to do it. It's like, okay, well, what do I talk about? Well, vlogs, you can talk about anything you want. But I feel like I've gotten to a point now where I've got something to say. Where before it was like, well, I don't, you know, who's going to be interested in what I have to say? Well, let's post it and see what happens. So, anyways, um, we've had an exciting, you know, 12 or 14 days here in our lives. And I'll tell you why, but there's a little bit of a story, just a brief one that I'm going to give you beforehand leading up to that. The last 23 months in my family um, have been very challenging. And uh, due to um, age and illness, keeping a, well, a rather long story short, in 2020, uh, my family suffered the loss of both my mother and my father, uh, less than three months apart. three months, March and July, and then um, from there, my wife Monica, her uh, mother developed lung cancer, and she passed away just a couple of weeks ago on January the 4th, I guess almost a month now, because we're past the 4th of February, so, <coughs> excuse me, uh, so we, we lost her as well, and we also lost Monica's great-grandmother, which is her mother's mother. Uh, this past October of 2021. So we've lost four important people in our lives in a matter of 23 months. And so it's, it's been a challenge. And, you know, you celebrate those lives, but you mourn those losses. And it's hard to mourn them when there's another one right after the other. And it's, it's been a tough go. Um, but that doesn't, um, that doesn't necessarily lead us where we are at this moment. <clears throat> What it does is it gives you a bit of a background to know that it's been an interesting, challenging time over the last 23 months. But what we've done is we lived in uh, Hamilton, Ontario. I grew up in, in Hamilton, Ontario. <coughs> and uh, we have since picked up roots and we are now located and settled here in Nova Scotia. We bought a house in a little town. It's, it was once a little town. It's it's a part of another town now. Uh, but we live in Millsville, Nova Scotia, which is actually part of Scottsburn. So our mailing address would be Scottsburn. Uh, our oldest son, Will, lived in Halifax. And we wanted to move out here to be closer to him and um, give our youngest, Zachary, a chance to <clears throat> see life in other areas of Canada and uh, enjoy Nova Scotia. And I just want to say on this vlog right now is that the move to Nova Scotia, we've only been here 12 days, has been such a breath of fresh air. I don't know if it's because of, of the, the challenges that we faced over the last several years in, in Ontario, but it just feels so freeing and the people here are so friendly and open and willing to talk and you say, oh yeah, I just moved here last week and they'll say, oh, where'd you move from? Oh, Ontario. Wow, welcome to Ontario. We're, we're, we're so glad you're here and they're so willing to be there for us and ask questions about us and, and if there's anything you can do, we can do to help you, let us know. I went into one place to ask if they had any work because I'm, I came here uh, unemployed. <clears throat> and she said, no, we're not hiring here, but um, let me give you a list of some other places that that might be hiring. She gave me a list of places. She was a, she was a an administrator at a lumber yard, and she gave me a list of possible companies and organizations that may be hiring right now. And also, she gave me a list of um, job sites that I could go to for work in Nova Scotia. And she didn't have to do that. She spent a half an hour with me, helping me with my problem. And that's the way people are here. They're just so willing to be there for each other. And I I get up in the morning and I'm so excited. I used to sleep in all the time. But this morning, I, 
we were up late last night unpacking boxes and I think it was about 5 a.m. when I got to bed and uh, I was up by 9 this morning <clears throat> doing stuff around the house getting ready to go because we're, uh, we're going into Halifax right now to pick Will up to pick up some furniture that we had purchased online for the house and we're just going in to do that now but we're, it's just I'm smiling from ear to ear all the time because I just find this place so energizing and exciting that I can't wait to get up in the morning to see what the day is going to bring. And I want to do these vlogs so that I can share the excitement of Nova Scotia. And the people around us are so helpful. And I'm going to share those stories of things that we've learned about Millsville, uh, the community that we're in, uh, Nova Scotia. And I'm going to share those things as we go. And I, I learned a little bit about Nova Scotia this past week that I'll share in another another video. But, <coughs> excuse me, so we're, we're so excited. And, and now that we're starting to get settled here, it's starting to feel like home. And I want to be able to share that home with you and what it means for us to be here in, uh, in Nova Scotia. So... These vlogs, you're going to see different vlogs, different days. I may just just tune in and... and uh, in 600 meters, oh, keep left going? at the fork to continue on Nova Scotia 118. Follow signs for Nova Scotia 107, Nova Scotia 111. Now you know exactly where I am. Uh, no secrets here. I still don't know my way around here, so I kind of have to do the, the... Keep left at the fork to continue on Nova Scotia 118. The GPS thing, I'm heading to Costco before I pick Will up. And this is the only way to go. So, yeah, it's uh, it's such an exciting time, and the people are so dang friendly that uh, you just wanna you you wanna share it with with your friends and your family, and and what makes Nova Scotia so special. And it, quite honestly, it's different than Ontario, and I'll go into details about that later. But I want you to you know get excited. I mean. I'd like you to get excited about it. Maybe this bores you to death. But I want you to get excited about the different things that I'm going to share on this vlog over the next days, weeks, and months as we go. Because I want you to share in the, the, the joys and the challenges that we're going to face living here in Nova Scotia and some of the funny times that we've, that we've already had. So my advice to you is like and subscribe to my, my vlogs here and also keep an eye open for Zach's uh, YouTube videos because he's going to start them up again once we get his system up and running. We're having trouble with our internet out here uh, where we live so we're trying to get that all sorted out and that in itself is a story that I, I got to share with you at some point but yeah um, so there's going to be YouTube videos from Zach, there's going to be vlogs from me, uh, tune into the Wise Shot on Spotify for the latest podcast. I'm not sure what direction we're going to go with that yet, but we got a lot of ideas. And that's the thing. I had the podcast going, what, over a year ago, and I just, I didn't lose interest. I just didn't feel moved with any topics. And now I'm starting to feel like, hey, you know what? I got stuff to say, and I want to share it with, with the world. So we're going to do it in vlog style. We're going to do it in podcast style as well so tune into that the wide shot with dan franklin that's me and uh all those different things so like and subscribe to these vlogs i don't know what i'm going to call them yet and uh, uh i hope you enjoy the time that i'm going to share with you on here have a great day be safe and be kind to each other see you later